we have the depth um, that that you need um, to compete for something special. Um, but uh, we've seen uh, NBA seasons are, are unpredictable. Um, so you have to prepare for the unexpected. Uh, they're long seasons, so you need everybody to contribute. Uh, and we feel like we have a team uh, that has the pieces to be able to do that. When, when you work in this organization or play for this organization, you understand uh, that it's the expectations. Uh, but now when you have experience, uh, you understand that there's a lot of work that has to go in behind the scenes and it has to match those expectations. And guys that have been uh, all the way through uh, the challenge um, to the mountaintop uh, understand that um, that's what the hardest thing you'll ever have to commit to as a professional um, is to try to come together as a team. Uh, and that takes a lot of work and a lot of commitment. Uh, we understand why we're, we're here, uh, and we've talked about it enough. Uh, we're not running away from these expectations uh, of this team, uh, but we have to put in the work um, now. It's been long, right? Yeah, it's been long. It's been a great offseason, but we don't want too many offseasons like that anymore. Quizás el trabajo del coach Eric Spolstra pasó a ser uno de los más fáciles en la era LeBron James a ser uno de los más difíciles después que el mejor jugador de la NBA abandonó al Miami Heat. Lo cierto es que nadie puede dudar que este coach a sus 45 años ya tiene dos campeonatos en la NBA, además de haber llegado a cuatro finales, lo que se traduce en cuatro títulos en la Conferencia del Este. Desde la American Airlines Arena en Miami, Florida, Octavio Sequera para VamosDeportes.com.